Hello and welcome, I am Arumba. Thank you for joining me. I'm on episode number 29 now of Let's Play Lux Invicta for Crusader Kings 2. 29 glorious episodes of combat and battle as Emperor Sigurd I with his father, Emperor Herzog Fredegar. That was it. We're on character number two right now, surprisingly. So let's continue. One thing I was looking at is look at all these religions. This is It's just such an interesting mod because they're so fractured. It's not like... Blah, Catholic. Blah, Orthodox. Like, it, I mean, there's there's room for combat, room for battle in, like, every direction. It's quite cool. So, um, so yeah. I'm still a kinslaying lunatic. And, uh, my son, of course. Yes, yes, my son, the one that's actually my heir, is, is uh, also a, a lunatic. But he's not a kinslayer. He's content, which is unacceptable. So we need to get rid of that. Oh, are they changing who they support? Interesting, okay. Well, what I want to do is murder people and uh, try to get up to 3,000 authority in this video, ideally. So, let's see, the person who has the most power is this, this kid here, who is apparently a nine-year-old boy, and he controls 20% of the power of the realm. Quite a strong little lad. The, uh... He's under Gavelkind, but the issue is that he doesn't have any, any heirs gonna go up to like his mother or something if he dies. No, not his mother. Who is this woman? Richenza von Nassau. Nope, that's Gudrun. Who is it going to? Gudrun, okay. Hmm. Well that's interesting. If we kill the Duke, it'll go to her. And then if we kill her, it'll get split Gavelkind between these two boys. We could split up this this double duchy that he has, which might work a lot better. So, yeah. Are we already trying to kill him? No, we're trying to kill Herzogin Irmgard. Oh, that's right, because I wanted to attack her again. Um, well, that's not really... Oh, that is good enough. Let's let's wait. That's enough plot power. That might work. So, yeah. So, we got money. Um, not going to create duchies, because you lose authority to do that. I'm just going to kind of... We're going to... I don't know. Can we attack somebody else? Do we have any other... We have our du jour claims over here, vanquishment. Claim Pleasant. We can claim Pleasant. What is that? My vassal has a claim. It only costs four gold, and he has to pay for it. Yes! <laughs> yes! Let's do it. Attack. I have bloodlust. I wish I could make the bloodlust sound effect from, from Warcraft games. It's like... Or something like that. You know what I'm talking about, right? Of course you do. Everyone's played at least a Warcraft game, right? At least one. You have to have. It's like a rite of passage. Look at me, I look so glorious with my hat. I love it. And we'll have Fredegar, my son, and uh, my other son. Yes! Look at us! 28, 26, and 34. Which one's my heir? Fred is, was it Fredegar? I don't remember. Fredigar. And then my other son is, uh, oh, damn it, I named them both Fredigar, didn't I? Son of a... Okay, which, which one's the... Okay, 28 is the lunatic. Good. Got my lunatic on my... The, if I'm looking this my left hand, and we should switch him. Here. You're my right-hand man, you're my left-hand man. Let's go! Glorious combat. We're an amazing family. Lunatics. We need to make the other one a lunatic. Let's chase them over a river, why not? We're gonna get you. Coming for you. You can't escape us. Not for long. Going to Old Pole. Gonna have to cross the river. We're gonna catch you now. Gotcha. Get him. Yes. Watch one of my sons will die in combat. Wouldn't surprise me. Look at that morale gain. That's actually not that good. But I'm, of course, I crush my flank first. I win the I win the race. I'm the best. Oh, we're so we're such an amazing family. All right, so we want um, just the one county. So really, let's just go siege it. That'll probably be, well, no, let's. It'd be the fastest way to resolve the war, but not the most financially like beneficial way to resolve the war. Like, the guy whose land we're taking is this guy. So this one's really undefended. These ones are more defended. And uh, this one's really weak. I'm gonna take these four. So we'll take our 4,000, split it up into about 1,000. 
thousand apiece. Or so. As close as I can get to there. It's kind of tricky sometimes. There we go. Oh, oh. That's close enough. Okay, so stay, 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 stay. There we go. Spread out. Fan out. We need to Im imprison some women. We need new concubines. One thing that's kind of a kind of strange to me is that um, you can't actually offer a concubine to other characters. You can only, as the player, like you can only request a concubine. You can't can't give them. Um, so like, whereas with like, if you're playing as a Muslim or something, you can you can make your son marry multiple people by continuously offering him a marriage, but you can't force your children as a pagan to have extra concubines. And I just think it'd be kind of funny to have have our lunatic have tons of sons and children like me. He's not even married. Here, let's. Why are you not married? Didn't I arrange a marriage for you? I could have sworn I did. Are you betrothed? What the hell's wrong with you? Here, you marry a woman. What's going on here? Apparently I have no suitable women for him. Oh well, whatever. I'm sure he can't do anything too terrible. So yeah, we'll go up to speed four since we're just waiting for sieges. How are we doing on tech? Can we get another tech? Ooh, we can. We can get more military tech. Now now I have to consider whether I actually want to hold off um, and save up for like one of these 200 or 300 point things. Or if I want to, to just get like cavalry tactics. Well, let's see what the bulk of our army is. Like, if we go to the... The easiest way i found is you go to the garrison, and then look, look at the garrison. That'll tell you what the levy composition is also. It's the same ratio. So, we've got, um... No pikemen. 164. Clearly, it's, it's predominantly heavy infantry. So let's take the tech that buffs heavy infantry the most. Probably melee tactics. Even though we don't have pikemen. It'll just make them stupendously stronger. It's either that or the light infantry and archers, but no, we're gonna go with melee. Melee tactics. It's melee, not melee. People used to say it all the time. Oh no, I'm ill. I'll survive. I'm immune to death. I can't die. But yeah, I remember when I first started playing StarCraft, there were two terms people always got wrong. They'd call it melee and they'd call it zealots. They're not zealots, they're zealots. Zealots that are performing melee. Jesus. Yes. So limited control. Yes, now I remember. So limited control. We need to build control. Control, control, control. Build it. Good. Build more. More control. Not enough to siege that one. By 2,000. Wow. We'll go assist this one up here. But yes, I want prisoners so that we can ransom them, so that we can build control. Because control is awesome. We'll steal the banner because we're awesome. Put all kinds of banners in my hall. You can go there. You trying to surrender already? Wow, that's quite a garrison. Um, <clears throat> how close are we to sieging the next holding? Uh, we'll accept. That's fine. Thank you. So we've expanded the realm on behalf of my vassal. Which means that uh, I don't have to worry about getting rid of the land at all. Apparently he already gave it away. Does he have a really small domain limit or something? Yes, he can only hold two titles, so I gave it to him and he immediately gave it away. Even though he had a claim to it. Does he keep his claim? He... No, he doesn't even have his claim anymore. He's adventurous! He likes to meet new people and try new things. And kill them. Alright, what else can we do? Vanquishment Wars, Vanquishment Wars. Glorious Conquests, those are the ones that cost lots of money and stuff, and I don't want to do that. <coughs> We're up to 2760, so like one more good war. Get the du jour claim. Okay, so this is my neighbor that I, I have a truce with. So that would be a bad, bad idea. 2000 authority to do that. Um, she's only 27 though. And this one is only 16. And for some reason, my plot is gone. I don't... Oh, did she must have died. Does that mean our truce is gone? Oh, good, our truce is over with this one. Excellent. I didn't even see it. Um, which one do we want? We can take any one of these four. Well, this one has the highest total county taxation. These castles are kind of crap. Let's let's take the the one with the highest county tax. That one. 
And uh, we'll rally to Nuremberg. We'll start up building... Oh, we're actually still building stuff already. Good. <clears throat> Let's slow the game back down. See, I told you I wouldn't die. I'm immune to death. Death comes for me and fails. And women try, try to seduce me constantly. And, and I know about it and I let them do it. Because I'm amazing. Everyone wants to be with this lunatic man. Okay, let's get my sons together. Yes, come on, get the men. Get the men, rally the men. Okay, I'll take the center. We'll put uh, my heir on the right and the other one there. Yes. Glorious family of combat men. Improving their, their martial ability. We're up to a brilliant strategist on this one. And the other one is a tough soldier. So hopefully he'll upgrade. He might not. We're going to cross a, a major river into forests. We're still going to win. Whoa, though. Holy crap. Those are some nasty modifiers. Like, way, way worse than regular CK2. But we're still going to win. Because we have more men. And because we've got a, a family of genius, amazing conquerors. I'm not a genius, but my son is. One of my sons. Genius lunatic. But those are some serious combat modifiers. Like, dangerous. And these guys, they, they don't have very much, very many troops to defend, so I think we will spread out on all of them. New spy master, huh? Well, we'll go with this guy. How about we have him... Let's try studying technology just to see what happens. Go down there. <clears throat> okay, so we've got about 3,000 men, so let's go with armies of about... Say 900, roughly? Seven, seven, seven to 900? There we go. And we've built some large-scale large, sc large scribes training. I want control. Moderate control. Control? Do you already have control here? I'm not going to build the warrior cult because I don't plan on being able to, being able to play for a long period of time today. If I was going to play for like five or six videos, I would probably do it. Local scribes. So what does this do? Ecclesiasticism. That would give me more tech spread plus some more econ econ bleh, economic tech points. Where is this control thing? It must be one of these. Oh, there it is. Okay. Village head. We'll just keep building that, whatever. It's got, there's got to be a good reason to have it. <coughs> I can't stop thinking about all those prisoners in my dungeon there. At my complete mercy, what a thrill it would be to hurt them, to hear their sweet screams, to see the panic in their eyes. Uh, Oot. We're going to apparently, let's go figure out who we're picking on. Some person named Oot. So it's a 28-year-old dirty girl who's graceful. She's a graceful dog breeder. She's greedy and arbitrary, and apparently we're going to potentially wound her, kill her. Um, she's going to hate me. Right now she's got two opinions of me, but let's see. I've gained the cruel trait, and we maimed her. We, we apparently cut her eyes out, at least one of them. And so, of course, now she's very upset with me, um, as expected. <laughs> Oops. We had renowned puppet master happen to us. Interesting. This ruler knows how to pull just the right strings to play the noble game. Assassination chance is up. Health is up. Fertility is up 50%. Holy, holy crap. I, I, I already have 20% from hedonist, 20% from lustful, and now I have an extra 50% from this. This must be because my intrigue just went up to 15 Jeez, that is insane. If we didn't have enough children already, we're going to have more now. Jeez. Prince Fredegar of Rumbia has founded the Prince Fredegar for Germania faction. You impatient little brat. So he's what? He wants to be the emperor now. Well, let's kill him. I give you land and this is what you do? Why do you not like me? Succession law change, you think I'm a tyrant... You don't like elective... Oh, well, the fact that I'm a Kinslayer. <laughs> Dynasty member is funny. Plus five. Uh, Liege is cruel. Liege is lunatic. Aggressive offensive war. I was your mentor. I'm your father. Um, I'll make you the... 
Master of the Blade. And I'll also give you 20 gold. Now shut up. Shut up, Fredigar. Go home. You're drunk. Court Chaplain. We're still trying to convert stuff. It's not really working out so well for me. Furnished chick. Um, let's go with uh, our next door neighbor. Sure. And at 28.01, I think we're pretty likely to uh, to get to 3,000 here as soon as this war's over. Probably gain 100 from it, maybe. Let's go back up to speed 4 and see if we can get this done. You realize one day that you do not feel as vibrant or as capable as you used to be. After all, you are elderly now, having lived many decades. People only live so long, and sooner or later you too will die and join your forefathers in the afterlife. So I gain old age till the end of time. There goes two health. My martial score goes down, my learning score goes up. There goes renowned puppet master, since we lost some intrigue. Where was... Well, was old age a trait, then, that I picked up? Or is it... Oh, there it is right there. Well, that's unfortunate. I just barely had enough to make it interesting. And now I'm now I'm old. I'm going to die. Now I'm going to die, unfortunately. Okay, if you could go ahead and just surrender, that'd be great. Uh, we should probably ransom all of our prisoners, by the way. So, yeah. Well, I guess it's time for the next lunatic to take the throne. Okay, well, I'm going to take a break here, though. And I guess in the next video, the next time we get ill, we probably will die. And it's going to be uh, unfortunate. Build time goes up during war. Hmm. Probably should have considered that before building all this stuff. Oh, well, let's build another one anyway. More control. Okay, I will see you again in the next video. Thanks for watching, everyone. See you soon.